Hey, I found a slide in the literal middle of nowhere. You wanna go down it with me? Hello everyone, this is Rin from Super Cat Punch and welcome to- Oh, we actually just- a slide in the woods. Yes, I can get through an intro without getting immediately distracted, I promise. It's rare, but I can. And I- I- I didn't think we'd start... right in the action here. So it doesn't look like there's anything else for me to look at. Can I just wander off into the woods and get lost? Nope, okay. It wants me to stay focused and on task. Can I go up the wrong side of the slide? I don't actually know, aside from there being a slide in the woods, what this is. It sounds like wind, so it, it doesn't let you go in. <laughs> I'm glad they thought about that. It does not let you go in the wrong side. Ooh, nice sound effect there. Let's go down the slide. Well, that was surprisingly uneventful. Okay. It looked much darker on the on the Ichio page. Well, I assume one of these times it's not going to be normal. Oh. Well, now we're in Silent Hill. <laughs> Why is there nothing else to this little park? How did we get here? Why are we to be stuck in this awful, terrible loop? Oh. Oh no, it's real, is that it? Oh. Hello? Oh, it's a flashlight, okay. Oh, I like that sound. I like that sound, too. A lost flashlight. Luckily, it still has some battery left. Alright, well now we have a flashlight. We heard, I think, what was footsteps, so we're not alone here. Can I just jump off? Oh, That's the only other thing here, is this little pole. I remember those in the parks. They were awful to go down because usually they were, like... Sticky isn't the right word. But your hands did not glide easily over them, so sometimes you would get stuck and you'd get like awful... Burns isn't the right word either, but it, it would hurt. <laughs> it wouldn't feel very good. Oh hey! Is this a newspaper about missing people going down slides in the woods? Small town in mourning as a mass missing persons case at a local park continues to go unsolved. Reports say both children and adults are missing. A detective working on the case sheds light on its peculiarity, stating it's as if they'd appear- They'd appeared. <laughs> they disappeared into thin air. He asks that if anyone has any information pertaining to the case or if any victims spot one of the victims- If any victims spot victims. I can read, goodness gracious, to please contact law enforcement immediately. Alright, well- I assume I'm about to become a victim, so I will be on the lookout for any victims so I can report victims to the police. We got this. Hello? This is interesting. I, I do... I'm, I'm very hit or miss on loop type games because sometimes they can get really bland. But I think this does it pretty well. There's something that changes every time. Either it's the, the background sound, or an item appears, or the sky changes, or there's a different type of sound. I like that. Interesting. So when are we gonna- oh! Well now there's ketchup all over this. Oh! Alright, now, why? First of all, why would- why would we be here? Second of all, after seeing this, why would you get on the slide? Do you still want to get on the slide? Alright, I have a feeling this is gonna be a bumpy one. Let's go. Are we gonna come out the other side this time? I don't think we are. Oh, I can drift. 
<laughs> this is a long way this time. Oh. Crawl meter. Hold and then release space while moving forward to crawl. Oh. So that means we're going to have to, right? I'm gonna keep an eye on the sounds. I hear my heartbeat. I don't hear anything else aside from wind right now. Yeah, this is very interesting. I think it, it does the loop thing well. Alright, we're hearing that slide sound again. That's either someone running full speed up the slide, which was also fun as a kid. Like, if you took your socks off, which I'm realizing as an adult is absolutely gross in, like, the fast food playpen things. <laughs> you could, like, run up the slide and it would be super cool. And you wouldn't tell anybody your secret. It wasn't that you took your socks off. You're just magical and you can go the wrong way up the slide. <laughs> My little brother was so impressed with me. Can I... There we go. This is very safe. Oh. Alright, now we have really entered Silent Hill here. Do we go left? Do we go right? Let's go this way. Alright, now there's a giant staircase, which is very tempting. Why would we have a staircase going in the same way, though, that we just came from? Can I go this way? Can I go off? Can I just jump off into the abyss? No, okay. Whoa! Whoa, just giant chain. Holding this platform, I guess. What is this? I can't go any further this way. Okay. So let's just go... I can't go up here, right? No. I guess we'll go up the staircase. If I had to guess, it's probably the same on both sides. And I don't appear to be able to run. I'm trying to press both shift and space, and it doesn't seem to be going any faster, so... Like little bits of green, and there's still in here. Oh! Gonna be okay, buddy. All right, I'm sorry. I wonder what happens if you just don't move. Do you get a game over, or does it just go right through you? <laughs> I guess that would answer whether or not this is a dream, right? Okay, so they may or may not have come up there. Oh, hello. No, don't close the door. I'm sorry. I just wanted to look around before going in there. This looks like a pyramid or something that I'm about to get sacrificed on, I guess. Oh, it opened. I thought it was closing. Okay. Is that a heart? That sure looks like a heart. Oh. Okay. E to remove chain. Okay, but what if I want to just leave instead? I cannot. Okay. E. What's down there? I can't quite see it. E. Okay, the heart does not seem to like that. You're looking more like a trash bag. But that's okay. Uh, I guess that connects to that chain? Feed them? Oh, I guess it's a bag of struggling victims, maybe? That sure sounded like a heart, but... They hungry. What is it that we're feeding? I wonder. Oh, hey, buddy! I'm assuming I want to leave. Can I go this way? 
I don't appear to be able to leave. Okay. Maybe I can lure him around this. And then we'll walk out the door. Oh, this is opening. Okay. But you're so cool. Oh, you aren't actually a threat. Okay. Hi, buddy. Oh. Oh, maybe I shouldn't stay here. I can no longer move. <laughs> okay, I know I tempted fate. I'm sorry. I like how I, I said that it wasn't a threat and it immediately killed me. <laughs> Instant monster karma. Okay, I'm, I'm supposed to be able to leave, right? Hello? There we go, okay. Now let's actually leave. I'm sorry that I taunted you last time. Uh, please go. There we go. Alright, I'm going to assume it is chasing me, and I'm gonna want to... I'm gonna want to try and book it. Please, let me go. Okay. I like the directional sound here. That's really nice. It does make it sound like he's following you through the little maze. Ooh. It is a pretty tense moment. I think I did a good job on this part. I don't know if it's actually after me anymore, but I'm, I'm not gonna find out because that was a pretty long sequence. So I'd, I'd rather not. <laughs> but I'm assuming there is real danger here if there was real danger with just him standing at the door. So. We do not need to test fate. Oh, the creepy ambience stopped, so I assume we are home free. And most likely, uh, expired. Or maybe we do escape, I don't know. Let's see. But for right now, we're free fallen. Well, I know that isn't much of an angle, but you know. Alright, we're going down the side. Are we gonna come out the other side like it's normal? I knew it. Oh! Nice touch! The slide is just gone! I really liked that! Oh, I'm lagging. Hi. <laughs> oh, well, the game just closed. I guess it's just you and me here in the blackness now. You wanna go down the slide again?